walking west on 9th Avenue and the camera's on. It's running. The camera's on? Yeah, but we're outdoors. Oh. You remember the outdoors series? We're back. <laughs> we're Maybe Timmy wants to end the seminar. Well, remember when we used to do the seminar outdoors? Yeah. <laughs> we're back. <laughs> Outdoor seminar. I don't have any material handy. Let's see what's going to go. It doesn't here. matter. Oh, that's why we got scenery. There's nothing there. Here we go. Well, I'm walking to the library. <laughs> there we go. There's a brochure under the ashtray in the bathroom. Give me that brochure out of the ashtray in the bathroom. An upper respiratory infection is also called a cold. It can affect your child's nose, throat, ears, and sinuses. The cold is usually not serious and does not need special treatment. Healthy children usually get <laughs> at least like five cold each year. The child's cold flipping will be worse for the first three Are you reading better homes? Are you reading better homes and gardens? His cold should be gone in seven to fourteen days. Your child may continue to cough for two or three weeks, depending on how much smoke around them. Huh? Yeah. This is always talk to your child's primary health care provider. Before the younger children and babies, any medicine. Yeah. Most jobs are right, You got groupies over there right now, or what? The younger job, yeah, the viruses that they're giving a case in Africa are making them uh, paralyzed. Well, now they're working on some uh, non <laughs> contagious yeah. H5N1. Like they might go yeah. into the contagious strains next. <laughs> they may go into the contagious strains later. After not they got their HIV their virus thing. H, now they're up to H5N1, I think. H5N1. You just feed it. And then, and then uh, one guy, he went on Pierce Morgan, or Pierce. I'm not a doctor or what to say. It's not contagious it's yet, but we're working uh, on it. You got Inside. He got a flu shot, and he ended up sick two days later. Oh, well, duh. What do you think duh. about that? I said, well, duh. And then... <laughs> you're getting, uh, <laughs> You think you're getting a flu shot? Getting... You're getting H5N1 from the enemy! <laughs> and a nanobot Kids in are... your... And a nanobot. Kids are getting narcolepsy right after getting their shot. 800 of them so far. Let me explain that off. I, but I hope that I gotta keep an eye on Star about she gets narcolepsy, I guess. Are you gonna give her a virus? Or, yeah, I don't know if they just like administer mandatory shots at school when I'm not paying attention, or I don't know what's going on. And I try to keep an eye on it, but. And they got you in a control uh, system where you just don't know when they're going to give your child some she, shots. She's going to start nodding off uncontrollably here soon. I bet, I bet Grandma gives her every virus shot she could get. No, actually, I'm probably happy that Grandma's probably neglectful of those things because they don't worry about yeah. it. They aren't a bunch of retards where she comes from. Yeah. Um. Sorry to burst your bubble. Sorry to burst your bubble, but... Sorry, sorry to burst my bubble. I think right we're the most neglectful the family. We are one of the no most neglectful families in keeping up on shots than, than we you would ever know. I hope she got her tetanus shot. She was, like, scratching herself on that. You remember the nail was sticking on? Like, ooh, I hope she got a tetanus shot. <laughs> but I don't even know. They, they like keep it out of my hands and then I think they neglect it. 
to. First, we're going to take over, then we're going to neglect this. But that's, uh, you want to neglect your shots. You want to neglect your, you might get a nanobot or some narcolepsy medicine in there. I think this says that the library's closed. There's like a sign out here. That was. Oh, my stepdaddy had narcolepsy and he wrecked my Taurus. Driving home one day from work. Put in a ditch. Yeah. Yeah. Star has five new. Six new. When Star comes over, inshallah, there's six or seven new games on the. on the, uh iPod. Inshallah. <laughs> yeah, if I don't say that, everything like will go to hell. Like a, a meteorite will hit. Like right after I. That's kind of, something kind of like that happened to King Solomon. He forgot to say Inshallah, yeah. and everything went to hell for a day or two. Because <laughs> he said he was gonna. He said he was gonna like get all his wives pregnant so they could become princes of kingdoms. And if only he said Inshallah that day, they would have. But. Instead, all the children died at childbirth. Because he forgot to say inshallah, so... It's important to get that in there if you're projecting a future event that you're really counting on. <laughs> Especially. Especially in the Timmy case of a, your accounting Timmy on a future has a event. Timmy has a hunting sweatshirt on. A hunting, a hunting shirt? A what? 